What's going on guys? This is a start of Newcastle versus Liverpool day trip. Um, I guess this was the end of the uh, soccer Saturday day trip. I'm not in different clothes, I'm not in different state of mind. I'm fucked. Uh, we did soccer Saturday last night. I'm in Wolverhampton. Um, we were supposed to get the coach from Wolverhampton to... No, supposed to get the train from Wolverhampton to Coventry and then get the coach from Coventry to Newcastle because I booked the coach from Coventry to Newcastle. Uh, but that's not going to happen. Uh, I missed the coach. Woke up too late. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Uh, so I get a train. I'm about to get the train from Wolverhampton to Newcastle, which is going to cost me £73. Um, it's what it is, to be, to be fair. Um, not much I can do about that now. Uh, feeling absolutely horrendous. But what a night. What, 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 a, what a place Wolverhampton is for going out, honestly. Planet is the absolute best nightclub I've ever been to. Wow, the music in there was so good. So good. Um, but we, look, we're going to Newcastle right now. Uh, I'm going to get the 1022 train for Wolverhampton, which is going to get me to Birmingham in about an hour. And then Birmingham to Newcastle was about three hours. So, look, I don't feel good. Um, but it is what it is. I deserve this for doing soccer Saturday yesterday. Uh, Liverpool are taking on Newcastle. Let's do it. In Birmingham, a familiar place for me. Um, about to get on the train, the Edinburgh train. Uh, it's going to take me about three and a half hours, I believe, to get to Newcastle. I feel absolutely horrendous. I'd love to say I can get some sleep on this train. I doubt I will. Let's see how I get on. So I've arrived in Newcastle. I've somehow made it to Newcastle. I thought that journey was never going to end. Uh, but I'm here. It's half two and I'm here. Two hours till kick off. I'm going to need some sort of food. I can hardly walk. I feel dreadful. Um, I'm sure I'll pat myself up once the Reds march onto that football pitch. Come on, the Reds. So just over one hour till kick off, so team news will be out shortly. I can't even bring myself to be in a pub at the moment. <laughs> Uh, as I've mentioned before, I'm in a bad way. Uh, I'm stood outside the away end, I believe. Um, just waiting for team news, waiting for my ticket. Um, can't wait to get in the ground and just watch this game and get home, to be honest. Um, yeah, no interest in any sort of pints or anything like that. Um, but still excited for this game. <laughs> So there we have it. Um, just got out of the ground, one apiece there. Um, that long journey just for that. Sick of the same old shit. Um, I round us up when I get some food in me belly. So I'm just sort of waiting around for my train now, about 40 minutes uh, until that arrives and departs. There's been a lot of delays today, so hopefully I'm not caught up in those. Um, Oh, I'm in a fucking foul mood after Liverpool's draw there. Um, same old shite. Same problems. Um, I know a lot of you have been saying to me, let's keep calm, results will come, have patience and stuff. Um, unable to do that today. Uh, you, you can see the way this season's going. It's going to peter out as far as I'm concerned. Um, defence fucking pussies. I'm sorry, John Matic is not good enough to be Liverpool's best centre-back. I know a lot of you rate him. He has his days, he has his good days, but his defending for their goal is pathetic. So is Dan Lovren. Two substandard defenders. The worst centre-back partnership. The worst, best centre-back partnership Liverpool have had. When I say the, the worst 
first two, the worst first choice. Fucking dreadful. Uh, Moreno, daft footballer, stupid foul, stupid times. Everyone's talking about his renaissance, people seem to like him, I don't get why. Um, Joe Gomez is poor today, um, doesn't offer much going forward. Uh, shaky defensively again. Uh, always, always getting booked. Always looks like a red card waiting to happen. Not because he's a dirty player, just because he's always too slow to the ball. Uh, I don't want to get on his back. He's a young player. I'm sure he's going to be a great player, but at the moment he's in terrible, terrible form. Uh, that's probably harsh, but he, today he was terrible. Um, the strikers are too wasteful. Sturridge barely, barely looked interested today. Uh, Mane and Salah. Mane's touch was awful today. Salah was just wasteful. Um, Coutinho is great, uh, of course, another, another good goal for him. Henderson played well. Um, Van Alden was went missing. Uh, really frustrating day, really frustrating day. For me, we're, we're just not going to win the league. Um, we'll be lucky to get top four. I think that's going to be the battle now between sort of us, Arsenal. I expect Spurs and Chelsea to pull away eventually. I think maybe us and Arsenal. You know, for sort of fifth, maybe? I don't know. They seem to be the closest team to us, but even they put away teams that they should, whereas we just don't. We just don't put away teams that we should. Which is the same week. Uh, with the exception of Leicester last week. Uh, it's now one win in seven for Liverpool. I'm going to get on this train. I'm going to forget about football. And I'm going to round this up when I get back to London. Fuck sake. So it's now Monday night, I'm just editing the video, about to upload this one, so just thought I'd do an outro, I never actually got around to doing it last night, um, mixture of tiredness and just other stuff coming up, uh, but I've had a good sleep in me now, I've had time to think about, reflect on the game, as I said um, in Newcastle afterwards, pissed off, don't even want to think about Liverpool uh, tonight, um, really not looking good for us. Uh, as far as the day is concerned, Newcastle was a lovely, lovely city. It's the first time I've ever been properly. I think I passed through it before when we went to Sunderland away last season. Um, but first time I've really been there properly. Been to the first time to the ground, obviously, as well. Loved it. Loved the stadium. Loved the city. Definitely one I hope to go back to soon for, you know, obviously probably play them again there next season, but, you know, maybe a night out there soon as well. Um, overall, a really flat day, but a great, great weekend. Wolverhampton was quality. If you've not seen the uh, day trip video from the Soccer Saturday, please make sure you do. Um, it was quality, great night. Didn't meet my coach, which I thought I was going to. Just had to fork out £73 for that uh, train to Newcastle to watch us draw. And I did get caught up in the delays on the way back, which meant I had to wait around for a free taxi home, um, which took, it took a while. So look, a lot of traveling, a lot of waiting around, a lot of being tired and hungover all through the weekend, but a great one at that. Great night out with my mates, and, I, and then, you know, got to see the Reds, uh, even if they were crap. But we've got two weeks where I don't even have to think about Liverpool, which I think right now um, I need. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do subscribe to my channel for more of this sort of stuff. There's loads more of this to come, of course. Follow my other socials too. It's Ben Might Say on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. And I'll see you next time.